fork. How's the slice, Glenny boy? What do you mean slice? Went straight. What was that went sideways? That was a gull, you silly teacher. It's on my camcorders, three of them. They're below the windowsill, golf teacher. Oh, can't win. How was Glenny boy? He's pretending to think he's going to help you learn some of your golf skills in the coming months. Actually, he is. I got it figured out how he can do that. This is the third of my golf site announcements as I start to resume building my website, establishing a membership where golfers around the world can join in, learn some skills you've never learned before. My name is Glenn Osborne, as I've announced in previous announcements. I don't know if you can see this, but this is a golf pullover, windbreaker style, from Mount Brenton Golf Course. It's located in Chemanus, B.C., here on Vancouver Island. Chemanus is quite well known for wall murals. Their tours come from around the world to see these murals. But I paint the story of the growth of coal mining, railroad building in BC in the early years. I started this website in 2004, about July. I set up some instruction pages with videos and pictures. Shortly after, I couldn't carry on with it, but those pictures and videos sat there and while I was idle from the work for four years or so, my website has floated up to the top of the Google search algorithms and many keywords, keyword phrases, are now sitting in the top ten for searches of sometimes hundreds of thousands of pages. Google likes articles, instruction, videos, pictures, and that was back in 2004. They hadn't really solidified that, and here I had these uh, clips, no sound. They were very small, brief clips to maximize the poor bandwidth, meaning slow speed of internet transfers and so on. So, my website's right up there ahead of some of the big websites on golf. I get visitors from around the world. I've joined Twitter and two or three other of these social media sites and recently I'm getting Twitter forwarding or referring people to my website. And countries such as China, uh, some of the Indonesian or Indonesia countries where golf is starting to grow or take another growth spurt, there's visitors coming from these countries. Some of the big high profile golf tournaments that have been played uh, for the European and PGA Tours. Uh, in China, for instance, is a good example, really promoting the sport of golf there. There's currently a hundred million golfers in the world, approximately, but there's going to be a lot more coming in newer countries and with the younger children growing up. On my Twitter account, I just recently got a follow from a 12-year-old boy whose best round was a 73. I've encouraged that young fella to start a blog about his accomplishments. And you, too, if you have youngsters who are doing well, encourage them to form a blog and write about their 
uh, their efforts, what they're learning, who they learn from. Uh, at Natalie Gulbus is on Twitter. Natalie is a very high profile lady golfer promoting the golf throughout the world with her various activities. She started as a youngster with her dad and her grandfather. Awesome stories. So get out there and golf. Look for par threes. For the youngsters, it's very easy to have them land the golf ball on the green from a par three tee shot. Lots of encouragement. I'll talk more about this in future announcements. For now, here's Glenny boy. Whack. Look at that golf feature. Look at my swing. <laughs>